Hi and welcome to another NET Vapor Review. Today's review is another two e-liquids that I received from bestsigliquid.co.uk. Uh, my previous review was on another two e-liquids. So today we're going to do another two e-liquids from their company who sent me these e-liquids for the purpose of this review. So we're going to start off with the Black Fire. They all came, if you've seen my previous reviews, they all come, come in this bottle, this type of bottle. Um, it's a 70 VG 30 PG, 6 milligrams of nicotine on it. And the name Black Fire. Black Fire, the description on the website is... Blackfire naturally extracted real tobacco vape blend with hints of smoky bonfire night caramel and toffee. Very popular and delicious tobacco flavor. I'm quite looking forward to this one because I like bold tobaccos. Um, especially with the smoky bit is. It always reminds me of um, the quartet of the Black Note. That's a real smoky tobacco. Uh, okay, so we'll give it a go. Let's give it a shake. Um, I'll take out with my syringe a few drops, not too much, and moisten the coil of my um, Geek Vape Amit mouse along RDA. It's the top tank to test flavors on. This one and uh, Geek Vape Amit, and um, sorry. Van de Vee Berserker. They really bring out the flavors of complex e-liquids. Close the cap. That's it. And as usual, I'm vaping it on a 0.7 coil. A 0.8, sorry, 0.8, 0.79. So it's 0.8 coil. And on 18 watts. So let's try the black fire. Mm. Straight away, let me just give this a full open. I can do direct to long and then we'll do mouse to long. This is a lovely liquid. This is a lovely liquid. Well, it's it's not so smoky. <laughs> it says smoky on it. Hints of sm ah, that's why with hints of smoky bonfire night. I thought I would be hit with a smoky, heavy type of liquid like um, Quartet, for instance, or some NET.com type of liquids. They're very heavy and bold. No, this is, is a hint. Let's try it again. It's a lovely, rich, but smooth tobacco vape. I'll give it a bit more liquid. Very nice flavor. I like this flavor. Nice flavor. Let me see again what the website describes it. A blend with hints, um, real, naturally extracted real tobacco vape blend with hints of smoky bonfire night, caramel and toffee. So that's where the richness is coming from. Let's give it now a mouse too long. It's 
see the beauty of this tank is that with no hassle, no fuss, you can just change it from mouse to long. It's so easy, you just turn around. I, I have a review on this tank if you want to go have a look at it. It's a lovely, um, sweet notes of nearly chocolatey caramel, nearly a ch uh, chocolatey, very rich flavor of caramel. They say caramel and toffee. I, it's like a chocolatey ca caramelly one. <clears throat> Hot water and lemon is the best way to neutralize your mouth. It's a rich flavor of like a creamy type of toffee. You know, one of those chewy toffees caramel tree toffees it's like a creamy note to it with straight away I didn't say it was smoky but it's a, it's a bit of the earthiness of the tobacco in the background the tobacco here is not so pronounced in the liquor in the flavors the flavors you're getting first is more of the was the back note type of flavors, the 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 creaminess caramel toffee type of flavor comes first, and then the tobacco kicks in. If that makes sense. Yeah. I can't really taste any smokiness here. But maybe the smokiness adds that richness, the depthness of richness and the flavor of the caramel and the toffee. Maybe. Overall, it's a very pleasant flavor. It's an all-day vape for me. Very nice quite nice liquids they've got on their website um, manufacture good quality as I said in my previous review I'm happy to see that an English UK based company come up with decent good I should say good tobacco e-liquids they don't have to go all over all over the world to get them Yeah, this is an all-day vape. It's a very nice, richer, creamy type of tobacco vape. That's what it is. Okay, I better let this go because I've got another e-liquid to review. The next one is Burley. They all come again in the same bottles. To me, they came as, a, as a, to me to review. I don't know how you're going to get them if you buy them on the website, but I assume the same. Again, it's a 70 VG, 30 PG, 6 milligrams of nicotine. Let's give this a go. I'm trying this on the Berserker RDA. Hmm. I know what Burley tastes like. I've, I've vaped them quite a lot, naturally extracted tobacco Burleys. I wonder if this is going to taste as the naturally extracted tobacco burley um, that I've, I've been used to. We'll wait and see. Just saturate the coil. Okay. Put the cap on. This is a more of a complex tank to deal with because to get the right 
to get the right opening on this tank is not so simple as the other one but still the flavor is superb okay let's go this is vaping this on 0 0.7 watts on on well it was 20 uh, on 18 watts Mm. Sorry. This is not the typical burly that I'm used to, for instance, from Black Note or Forte or from Drake's the Burly blend or from naturallyextractedtobacco.com also they've got a burly blend this is more less bold less nutty and earthy more of a again a bit of a fruity note let's see what they what they describe it as a high grade air cured dark burly from fields of Kentucky mild but delivering a fine flavor and perfect for tobacco vapors There's a nice flavor to it, but it's not the same. Oh, you see, I want to open up to add a bit more juice, and it always gets very stiff. Let's add a bit more juice. It's a bit of a different type of burley, this is. Let's open it all the way so I can give it a direct along. Right. I think I oversaturated the cotton. Yeah, I always saturate the cotton. Mm, actually, it tastes quite good as well. It's more of a sweeter tobacco than the normal burley. Burley normally is a very dry, the least sweet tobacco. This is more of a sweeter. You do get the earthiness of a burley, but it's a it's a sweeter burley than I'm used to. Nevertheless, it's still a nice vape, but not as pure as the other burleys that I, I have got. That I must tell you. This burley is more for, there is two types of tobacco vapors. One, the pure, bold, naturally extracted tobacco type, like myself and I'm sure others. But there is those who like a not in, in your face tobacco. They like a tobacco flavor, but not too authentic, not too pure, with something to it, like a fruity note, a caramel note, a vanilla note, a creamy note, a fruity note, citrus notes, you know, something that will mellow the tobacco a bit. This, this Burley from Bessig Liquid is perfect for those vapors. And so is the black fire. The black fire is more of a bolder. You can taste more the the, the tobacco. 
it's more of a, what was it, a smoky, I don't know if it's smoky, but it's more of a, a desserty type, but you can taste the tobacco in it, but still got that toffee and caramel creaminess. And it, I can't taste the smokiness of it, but you can do taste the earthiness of it of the tobacco. The Burley is, in a, is a similar trend where the tobacco, I think the, the, this trend is, is really much the uh, best sig liquid type of um, base flavor, meaning that it's a tobacco, but not in your face tobacco. It's more of a tobacco with something to mellow the tobacco down, to give a vapor a, a, a feeling of vaping something similar to what he had with the cigarettes. Obviously not the smoke, smoke flavor because that is disgusting. No one wants to vape on smoke e-liquid. Smoky, smoky is something else than smoke. Smoky means it's like the, um, like an oak, like an oak flavor, like a woody type of bonfire type of um, smokiness to it. That's something else. That's a very good liquid when you get the proper smokiness to it. Um, <clears throat> that comes from the tobacco itself. But these tobaccos in general are more of a mellow, some of them a bit stronger than others, but all of them are more or less mild, um, sweetish tobacco with something else in the background depending on every every liquid so for instance this burley is not a pure burley like the forte black note or a burley blend from drake's or from net.com this is more of a um, flavored burley so it's very good for smokers or ex-smokers who want the taste of tobacco but don't want it in too bold. That makes sense to you. Very nice. Oh, <coughs> see, I'm being. Uh... <clears throat> Yeah, it's a very nice liquid. Um, it's all day vape. But for me, a burly is... I, I prefer the more in your face type of burly, but I'm sure there's a lot, of you, lot you, a lot of you out there who don't want in your face tobacco. This is perfect for you. Yeah, very nice. So that was the uh, the burly and the uh, black fire. Both are nice. All the vapes. Naturally extracted tobacco with different flavor profiles in the background. The black fire is more of a richer, creamier, chocolatier type of vape, and the burly is more of a. I would say I will call it a. Swedish fruity type of uh, tobacco vape. Yeah, I think so. Both are definitely all day vapes. And both are nice in their own right. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this review. Um, enjoy your vape, and until the next review, take care. Bye bye for now.